what is my identity? For people that have, you know, that were taken from their families and they were placed with white families and they're disconnected from their culture and they grew up in the white culture, in the mainstream culture. Some of them didn't even know they were indigenous and they find out as, an, as adults. They're like, well, do I have the right to call myself indigenous? Do I have the right to try and find my culture? Then you have others that, you know, like myself, who were raised in the predominant mainstream society, knowing you had indigenous ancestry, uh, but it wasn't really talked about. And then it's like, well, trying to go and find it and find records and hunt that down. So it's like, well, how do I legitimize this, right? It's that sense of I'm, I'm having to, you know, legitimize my experience, my identity to the world, right? Do I need to do that? Do I not? Um, so really it's about, you know, when people come in and they're like, I'm really confused about my identity, um, we explore that and we explore all of these different things and how the world perceives, perceives them, how they perceive themselves. You know, sometimes there's a disconnect between what they think the world sees and how they see themselves. Sometimes they match up perfectly. And really it's just about, you know, exploring what that means to them and what they are, you know, looking for. Are they looking to connect to a specific culture? Are they looking to explore? Are they looking to have a firm sense of identity? Or are they, you know, looking to be okay with the kind of the multi-ethnic, um, you know, melange that they are, right? It's, again, it goes back to, you know, what does the client want?